Hi everyone, Radhe Radhe. In this video, we're going to be doing chapter 7, verse 11. And uh, Bhagavan Sri Krishna continues to talk about how um, he is the source of everything in life. And it's it's again another beautiful um, chapter. I had to go through it. It was a little bit confusing. Um, so I, I'll, I'll, I'll explain why it was confusing. Okay, let's sing the verse together. Balam balavatam chaham kamaraga vivarjitam dharma virudho bhuteshu kamosmi bharata shabha. I am the strength of the strong, devoid of passion and desire. I am the sex life which is not contrary to religious principles, O Lord of Bharats. Similar here as well, O best of Bharats, Bharata, Arjun. I, in strong persons, I am the strength, devoid of desire and passion. I am sexual activity not conflicting with virtue or scripture, scriptural inject, injunctions. Um, okay, so calm here uh, is translated in so many ways. By, by Prabhupada, it's always translated as passion. I uh, have translated it as desire in my mind, but you can uh, go with Prabhupada's uh, thing. Here also he says calm is desire. I've seen calm being translated as desire in many places, so I think of it as desire. But this calm, there's two way, places where calm is common. This first one is desire. The second one is sex life. Both of them have translated it as that, and they've given the similar reason. So I went through this. Uh, there is this uh, um, website which gives uh, translations by many different places, you know, Madhvacharya and uh, uh, Sridhar Swami and Ramanujacharya and things like that. So I've read that as well to try to understand if it, if they mean sex life there or not. Um, so yeah, some people, so in this case, uh, Sridhar Swami did say that and Madhvacharya, um, I think, the so Adi Shankracharya said I, I didn't understand what uh, Madhvacharya said, but Adi Shankracharya said, uh, where is it? Yeah. So he said the the karma desire again. He's called it desire, but desires for eating, drinking, and all of that. That is not dharma avirudh. So it's it's uh, you can take it in many different ways. Okay, so let's do word by word. Balam balam balavatam. Balam is strength. Balam vatam of the strong. I am also the strength of the strong. I am the desire and attachment. Rag is attachment. Uh, I am devoid of rag and attachment. Uh, I am devoid of passion and attachment. So here he said two things. I am the strength of the strong and devoid of passion and desire. Um, here he said in the strong people I am their strength devoid of de desire and passion. So it's slightly different. Like he's saying I am the strength which is devoid of. And here he's saying as two different things. Strong as well as devoid of passion and desire. Uh, or maybe it's the same thing. I don't know. Maybe I'm misunderstanding. Okay. Dharma aviruddha, not against re religious principles, but what? In Bhuteshu, in all living beings, Kama, sex life, I am. Oh, oh, Arjun. So I am the sex life in all living beings, not against religious principles, which both of them have translated as uh, having sex for the only for the purpose of having children, Krishna conscious children. And he's also written the same thing, you know, um, having uh, Krishna mentioned that within, he's the controlled, virtuous, well-intended sexual activity of the householder. And uh, here uh, uh, Adi Shankracharya has said uh, uh, that the it's also called a desire and desires for eating, drinking, etc. So dharma avirodha, but not, yeah, so it's not just sex life, but any desire. So yeah, however, However you want to translate that, but that's what it means. So basically he's saying that I am the, the strength of the strong. I am devoid of passion and desire and I am the sex life, which is not contrary to religious principles. Oh, Arjun. Okay. So that's it for this verse. We'll do chapter 7 verse 12 in the next video. Wish you a day filled with lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of spiritual growth. Radhe, Radhe.